being great. Today we are going to do a read aloud. Miss Nelson is missing and remember this book? Yes, read again with me. Miss Nelson is? Yes, missing. Good job reading missing. I got to teach you how to read the titles of these books now. You're all grown up by now. I read you so many stories. Okay? Miss Nelson is missing. Now let's start. Maybe something terrible happened to Miss Nelson. Maybe she was gobbled up by a shark, said one of the kids. But that didn't seem likely. Sharks, very unpleasant. Maybe Miss Nelson went to Mars, said another kid. But that didn't seem likely either. Oh, Mars. And this is, yes, Earth. Yes, Earth. That's where we're living on right now. I know, exclaimed one, no, it all. Maybe Miss Nelson's car was carried off by a swarm of angry butterflies. But that was the least likely of all. <laughs> Is that possible? No. The kids in room 207 became very discouraged. It seemed that Miss Nelson was never coming back. And they would be stuck with Miss Wild Law. I a uh, uh, Lila Swamp forever. They heard footsteps in the hall. Here comes the witch, they whispered. Hello, children, someone said in a sweet voice. Who could it be, guys? It was Miss Nelson. Did you miss me? She asked. We certainly did, cried all the kids. Were where were you? That's my little secret, said Miss Nelson. How about a story hour? Oh, yes, cried the kids. Miss Nelson noticed that during story hour, no one was rude or silly. What brought about the love, this lovely change? She said, that's our little secret said the kids. Let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nine? Nine kids. Back home, Miss Nelson took off her coat and hung it in the closet. Right next to an ugly black dress. Oh my gosh, that's... She was Miss Vile Law Swan. Maybe, but that is silly. Who noticed that? <laughs> I didn't. Black dress. When it was time for bed, she sang a little song. I will never tell, she said to herself with a smile. Oh my gosh, that's the black dress right there. You see it? I know you can see it. Better? Oh, okay, now everybody see it. Okay, now that is silly. P dot S dot Detective Mac it, Smog is working on a new case. Who is he looking for? Yes, he is now looking for Miss Viola Swamp. And who's Miss Viola Swamp? You know it. Miss Nelson. Good job. He, he didn't realize it was Miss Nelson in that dress. But how was she right? And like that? Maybe she paid herself? Okay. Okay, bye guys. I hope you enjoyed the reading we read today. And what this story title? Yes, Miss Nelson is missing. I hope you enjoy uh, Miss Nelson is missing. We read today. Bye.